Meghan Markle not accompanying Prince Harry to the UK on his upcoming visit speaks of her antipathy to Britain, a royal expert has claimed. It has been revealed that Harry will celebrate the achievements and resilience of seriously ill youngsters and their families supported by well child at the event being staged in London on September 7, the eve of the first anniversary of the late Queen's death. Harry has been well child's patron for 15 years and regularly attends its annual awards ceremony but is not expected to be joined by Meghan who has been a guest at past events in 2018 and 2019. And according to royal expert and historian Dr. Tessa Dunlop, Meghan's expected no, show says a lot about how she feels about being back in the UK. She told The Mirror, contrary to some predictions, Harry is now popping over to the UK on route to Dusseldorf, Germany, and the Invictus Games. As is the case with all things Sussex, his visit is already causing a stir. Crucially the timing means he'll be in Britain on September 8 the first anniversary of the death of his grandmother, the late Queen. A poignant day that begs the question, will there be a family reunion? The answer is a firm no. For King Charles, the Queen's death doubles as his own accession and hell spend it in quiet contemplation miles away in Balmoral, Scotland. Can you blame him? Meanwhile Harry, on his own mission to prove his is also a life of service, will be hosting a charity awards ceremony for Well Child on the eve of the Queen's anniversary in London. The scenes involving children with severe health issues and their carers will be touching but don't expect Meghan in any of the pictures. Apparently she is not gracing London with her presence. A rare Sussex double act is being saved for Germany where the Duchess will assist Harry with the closing ceremony. On this occasion, I suspect Meghan's no show in London says more about her antipathy towards Britain than the couple's relationship. We don't deserve her, at least so she probably thinks. Also, Terry's that outstanding issue regarding the couple's UK security and who pays for it. Not only is Meghan not expected to be with Harry, sources have said that he will not be meeting up with his father King Charles nor his estranged brother Prince William. The Prince of Wales bore the brunt of Harry's criticism in his memoir Spare, where he claimed William physically attacked him. According to Tessa, it is not surprising given that William has often proved he is not a man for turning. She explained. The prospect of Harry on his Todd in London raises another prospect, what about a rapprochement between the two brothers? Again, the answer is negative. Apparently, the Prince of Wales will be in Wales and if the Women's Football World Cup has taught us anything, it's that William is not a man for turning. Harry might be waiting some time for that apology. Which apology? Who owes who an apology? Well quite, I rest my case. The impasse between the two brothers is as solid as ever. So to conclude, the Duke of Sussex blink, and, you, miss, him appearance in the UK will center on Well Child's awards ceremony and a perhaps fleeting visit to see his preferred cousins, Eugenie and Beatrice. A reminder that all is not lost among some of the Windsor Brigade.